Nathan Holman, welcome to uh, Glenelg Golf Club in South Australia for the 2013 Classic. How many times have you been here in Adelaide? Uh, this is my third time now. I've played the last two years and this is my third time. Good, year currently Australian number three Yeah, in the yeah. Australian team at the moment. Um, had some good form over the last 12 months. Yeah, what what tournaments are you winning? I, uh, I won Mandra Open and then I played a fair few pro tournaments earlier this year, which it's a good experience, I played well in those, so the form leading into the event's been really good. 75 yesterday, first round, probably not as good as you would like, and uh, rumour tells me 63 in the Pro-Am the day yeah. before. I wish, uh, I wish I could have reversed those, but I mean, there's three days left and the scores probably aren't going to get that much better because it's a pretty tough golf course, so hopefully I can uh, work my way back into it. What do you find about Glenelg Golf Club? What do you feel like uh, the features of the place are? And... The greens, I think. So I find it really hard to putt around here, it's really tricky and I mean, you don't have to be long off the tee or anything, but it's, I think, around the greens in the short game is really important around this golf course. We come from Melbourne Sandbelt. Uh, bunkers are a feature there. I like to think the uh, bunkers are a feature of our golf course. How do you find those? Uh, touch wood, I haven't been in any yet, so <laughs> hopefully I won't have to play any bunk shots. But, I mean, they are, they're well positioned and around the greens there. I mean, if you are short side yourself on one of these holes, it's uh, going to be pretty hard to get up. Good, and what have uh, what you got planned for the rest of the year? I'm going to head overseas to Scotland and America in May um, and I'll come back and play Bill Mamma to golf and hopefully turn pro at the end of the year. Excellent. Well, uh, good luck for the rest of the tournament, mate. Uh, see so you can get one of those 63s yeah. and they'll get you right back in there. Thanks, Thanks Nathan. Mate. We've got Grace Lennon here from Kingston Heath in Victoria. Uh, welcome to Glenelg, Grace. Um, how are you finding the golf course so far? Thank you. Um, yeah, the golf course is great. Uh, a lot of tricky holes out here. so. Uh, it's just about placement and looking forward to making a couple of different decisions today and uh, hopefully get a good score on the board. Currently Australian number three, um, very strong team. Um, your world rankings are all very, very high. Um, not your best start yesterday, but you're, you're still in the tournament. Um, what do you feel the, are going to be the feature holes for the rest of the weekend? Yeah, I think... Uh, I think that uh, I need to make amends on 17. I triple bogeyed that hole yesterday, so uh, I've got a few shots uh, up my sleeve there. But I think just uh, putting the ball in a good position and um, trying to play smart and not getting too greedy are probably the, the key um, factors to play well around as well. Very good. You've brought some, uh, some great form into this uh, tournament. Um, a lot of qualifying um, rounds in the straight play events we've had, you've done really well. Um, that's been rewarded with a Queen Syracuse uh, team berth. Yeah, I'm um, very honoured to be selected in that team and we're going to Taiwan uh, next week or the week after. Um, so I'm looking forward to that experience and um, really excited to be uh, teamed with Minji and Suo. So uh, definitely looking forward to that and yeah, as I said, it's a great honour to be selected in that team. And just one last thing, currently holding a plus six handicap. How does that go on the ladies' stable foot back at Kingston <laughs> Yeah, I don't Heath? really like playing stable foot on par. <laughs> I can imagine. Well, good luck for the rest of the week, Grace. Thank um, thanks for your time, and um, let's have a low one today. No worries, thank you. Okay, Ricky Cato. Um, welcome to Glenelg Golf Club. Um, Ricky, you're from New South Wales. Um, how many times have you played here at Glenelg? No, this is my first year. First time? Yeah. Started off with a nice 70 yesterday, one yeah. under par. Yeah, played pretty good. I did. Awesome. Putted awesome, that's Putted fantastic awesome. Um, to hear. How do you like the golf course? Yeah, it's pretty tough off the tee, like fairway bunkers and pretty long, some holes. And I wasn't hitting it very well yesterday, so I was hitting from the trees most of the time, but yeah, chip, chipped and putted pretty good. This last year, you've had uh, you've had a good year. You were part of the Toyota World Junior team yeah. uh, for the Australian team. How was that experience? Yeah, it was awesome, like because it's my second home, Japan, and Playing there and um, experiencing the culture and stuff was pretty good. Um, what have you got planned for the uh, the rest of the year, 2013? Well, I've got uh, men's interstate next. After this tournament, then I'm going to Japan to defend the Toyota World and Japan Amateur. Then I've got uh, the US trip coming up. Fantastic. Sounds like a um, full year. Features of the golf course. Obviously, we've got some pretty strong bunkering here. We like yeah. to think the greens are... Um, you know, I've got a few tricks in them for you. Um, Greens are running pretty fast. Yep, 11.75 yeah. I think we were told this morning, so yeah. nice and quick. Um, what do you think is going to be a, a winning score by the end of the week? Um, I don't know how the wind's 
where I'm going to end up today, but probably about five, six, seven. Yep, yeah, okay, I think it was maybe four last year. Um, good luck for the rest of the week, mate. Cheers. Okay, keep it going, another couple of 70s, and you'll be uh, right up the top of the board. Thank you. Thanks, Ricky. Thank you.